Hello, and welcome to this video series on Tableau for FIRST Robotics Applications, presented by FRC Team 2834, the Bionic Blackhawks, out of Bloomfield Hills, Michigan. First of all, I would like to congratulate everyone watching this video on taking your team to the next level. Numbers and data are some of the most crucial things towards making strategic decisions for your team and helping yourselves win competitions again and again. So without further ado, let's get started. What are you going to learn in this course? Well, most importantly, how to win with data. And you're also going to learn some of the smaller things that have to do with Tableau. How to format and import data sources into Tableau. How to create basic and advanced charts using your scouting data. How to filter your data for better analysis. And other cool applications of Tableau for FIRST Robotics. Now, if you're not familiar with scouting or how to collect your scouting data and the various different methods of collecting scouting data, I'm going to create a completely different video series on that. But that does not mean that you cannot watch and benefit from this video series. All you need for this is a computer that can run Tableau and a, an Excel program or Google Sheets or some other spreadsheet editor. So what is Tableau? Tableau is an advanced data visualization software that has several versions. Tableau Public is one of those versions. It's free for everyone to download, and it has most of the great features that Tableau has to offer. However, the only drawback is that files can't be saved locally, and they're uploaded to the Tableau cloud. The other more popular version of Tableau is Tableau Desktop, which is a paid version for $35 a month or it is free to college students and post-secondary educators. It is also free, at least in 2020 and the years prior, to all FRC teams during their season, and each team has been given five license keys in their virtual kit of parts. And this has all the great Tableau features, uh, including being able to save your files locally on your computer. So what are you going to need to get started? You're going to need a version of either Tableau Public or Tableau Desktop downloaded on your PC or Mac, and you're going to need a method to edit spreadsheets, such as Excel, Google Sheets, Apple Numbers, or any other spreadsheet editing software. So let's move on to how to download Tableau. So the first thing you're going to want to do if you're downloading Tableau Public, which Tableau Public will be just fine to use for this course, um, I will be using Tableau Desktop, but everything that I'm doing on Tableau Desktop, you will also be able to replicate in Tableau Public without any changes. So go to this link, which is in the description. You're going to enter your email address into this slot right here, and you're going to hit download the app. Uh, Tableau is going to probably send you some emails, uh, maybe some spam emails, but you can always hit unsubscribe from their emails. Uh, if they become too annoying, or you can just put them into your spam folder automatically. Uh, if you are not wanting to get Tableau Public and you'd like to upgrade to Tableau Desktop, and you are not wanting to pay for it, and you are not getting a Tableau license key from your team, you can get a student license by going to this page, the link is also in the description, and clicking Get Tableau for Free. Uh, Tableau is going to want to confirm that you are a post-secondary student or educator, so it's going to make you enter some information to prove that, such as a picture of a transcript or a student ID, and usually they'll get back to you within two to three days with your Tableau license key. Thank you for watching this video, and we're going to be back next time with how to import a data source into Tableau. See you guys later.